Stan Jabalisco here. Uh, a little plug for my book, Teach Yourself Electricity and Electronics. And then a little uh, example of something from that book that you'll find in Chapter 18. And that is the concept of an auto transformer. What is an auto transformer? Well, we're looking right now at Figure 18-8. And uh, there are three examples of auto transformers. This one has an air core. That one has a laminated or solid iron core. And that one has a powdered iron core. Uh, you can uh, notice that uh, just a single winding comprises the entire transformer. Uh, so there will be no isolation between the primary and secondary with respect to direct current. That is the chief limitation of this type of transformer. Here at A we have an air core coil which will step down an impedance. The primary is taken across the entire winding, the secondary across only part of it. Uh, you will remember the formula for impedance transfer ratio uh, is the square of the turns ratio. So for example if we tap this thing in the middle we will have a 4 to 1 step down impedance. Here with the laminated iron core this would be suitable for say alternating current. Uh, step down transformer you might put 120 volts across the entire primary winding. Uh, or in, uh, no I'm sorry you might put 100 and, you might put 120 volts across the entire primary winding yes and the secondary winding has twice as many turns as the primary, so in theory at least you should be able to step the voltage up to 240 volts. Uh, in practice there's a limitation to how large you can make this step-up ratio with alternating current uh, because if you load down the secondary too much in a transformer like this you're likely to see a voltage drop which is not so good. If, if you're looking to make a power supply, the best way to go is a transformer with a separate secondary and primary winding. Here at C we have a powdered iron core. Again, might be suitable for audio or radio frequencies. Uh, the primary and the secondary, once again, we have a step-up transformer. Uh, at radio frequencies, you can, in fact, step up the uh, impedance considerably. Uh, but uh, in the case of audio, if you have a powdered iron core, you have to be careful. You don't want to load down the secondary too much or you'll suffer some degradation in performance. But that's basically the concept of an auto transformer. It means it has just one winding, so it offers no DC isolation. It's not suitable for coupling one amplifier stage to another, for example, but you might do all right if in antenna tuning networks particularly these types of uh, coils and transformers are fairly commonly seen. Stan Gibalisco, Teach Yourself Electricity and Electronics. Look for me on the web at sciencewriter.net or go to my Amazon uh, home page and I will provide a link to this uh, book in the description of this video, Stan Jabalisco signing off. Until next time, so long.